Good morning everyone. Today we are going to learn about how to use has got and have got in sentences. Are you ready? Let's begin. Has got and have got are used to show someone's possession. In Tamil, we call it Ullathu Allathu irukkinradu Adadu manarukle Nammidamo ila matraviridamo Enna irukkinradu Appidi inradu Kurikkira Vaathaykal thaa In the has got, have got Rendutthukume uure aartham thaa Ullathu Has got Has got is used with singular nouns example of singular nouns are he she it or it can be a name of a person for example like sam or it can be just like the dog the man the lady now let's look at some common singular nouns he he is used to refer to a boy or a man he hendral avan she she is used to refer to a girl or a lady she hendral aval it it is used to refer to an animal or an object it hendral Adhi. So these are some example of singular nouns that usually used with has got. Now let's look at the example. Can you read it for me? He has got blue eyes. He has got blue eyes. So, this is the meaning of the word. He has got blue eyes. So, has got is the word. She has got blue eyes. She has got blue eyes. He has got blue eyes. He has got blue eyes. He has got blue eyes. it has got blue eyes adukku neela nira kangal irukindrana so inga adu nu vande oru murugatha kurikkalam adu pooniya irukalam naaya irukalam seriya manavargale let's move on have got have got is usually used with plural nouns i i means none you you means me we we means naangal they they means avargal and you must be asking teacher teacher why i and you i are plural nouns because there is only one yes but in english i and you are always special cases where we consider them as plural noun so i you we they are usually belongs to one group so all the grammar rules that applies for we and they also apply for i and you so manarle i you i na naan you na ni so ondru dana teacher eppadi plural noun sorum appdi nam teacher idu patti erkene velakam koduthirpen so english la eppodume i you we they vande or kulu so we they ke enna rules nam english la use pandromo ena vidhimari use pandromo adhe da i mattum you endra vaarthikku adangu okay I have got blue eyes. I have got blue eyes. 
எனக்கு நீல நிற கண்கள் உள்ளன எங்களுக்கு நீல நிற கண்கள் உள்ளன They have got blue eyes. They have got blue eyes. அவர்களுக்கு நீல நிற கண்கள் உள்ளன So if you notice, we use have got with I, U, V and they. Now let's describe the pictures. with has got or have got who is this boy let me introduce him to you he is mark he has got curly hair now here i have used the word he to refer to mark because mark is a boy and to describe mark's hair i say he has got curly hair i can also describe mark's hair as he has got black hair now let's look at some other examples mailing she's mailing she has got straight hair so she is the singular pronoun mailing is a girl so i have used the singular pronoun she to refer to mailing she's mailing she has got straight hair you can even say she has got black hair misty it's misty it has got white fur i have used singular pronoun it to refer to misty because misty is a dog it is an animal so we cannot use he or she so it's misty it has got white fur you can also say he has got blue eyes now who is this yes this is me I'm Puvanis. I have got big eyes. So here if you notice I didn't use the word has got. I have used have got because we use have got with pronouns such as I, you, we and they. Yes, well done. Let's look at another example. We We are siblings. We have got blonde hair. How else can you describe we in this picture? Yes, you can say we have got black eyes. Well done. Hope you have understood today's lesson. Have fun learning. Bye.